Round one, fight! Like, as I was saying before, this is a really bad matchup for Kung Lao. That's a matchup on top of that that Crazy's really familiar with. Most of the reason actually is because of Keyboard. When Keyboard first joined the scene, he was very random. And he really caught a lot of people by surprise because he, he was random but not bad. He was extremely random and extremely unsafe. And it was kind of like, why would you even do that? You know, one of those deals. So he's like, forget this. I'm gonna stop losing this guy. Round two. I'm just gonna figure out the character. Now, Kung Lao's really flexible characters. We can see right now he's actually trying to zone Cyrax. Didn't work out too well for him there. He's gonna be huge damage. Breaks before the reset lands. Still a considerable amount of damage. 440. And this should be the end of EG keyboard player. Oh no, he drops it. Gives him another chance. The X net does not connect. Alright, the, the tides have turned. It's pretty even right now. One one full combo from either character is going to win. Alright, well, Crazy takes it. I think it's 1-0. Oh. Is it 1-0? Oh? You should use your Kenshi again. Your amazing Kenshi. Oh, this water is amazing. So it's like very clean and got a little bit of lemon in it. And uh, I feel like I'm going to die in the first place, so this is wonderful. Now, Keyboard is a relatively, he's still relatively new to the scene, although he's, he's definitely become one of the, the four kings of SoCal. I think I'm going to call them the four kings of SoCal. Tyrant, X-Blades, Crazy, and Keyboard. That was too bad. Most likely, you're going to be seeing these four at the top of any given SoCal tournament. Not always, though. Not always. Of course, Vegas comes out a lot, too, so that they can too. And anti -airs. Like I was saying earlier, that's really one of the, the big reasons why Cyrax controls Kung Lao. No matter what Kung Lao does in the air, he cannot beat the anti -air. Okay. There's an X-ray. Now this is a really, really risky choice against Cyrax because it does use all of your meter, and Cyrax does do you know 90 to 100 percent damage in one combo. So he no longer has the meter to break. He's leaving himself. Oh wow! Hit him with the bomb on the way up from the teleport. Without meter, Kung Lao is vulnerable to a reset. I see the entire thing. Now I bet we're gonna see an X-ray. I would have broke that. Just thought it could really. Happen. Oh, oh! I would have. I would just say that X-ray, man. X-ray is a. It's a. His specifically is a really good option against the teleport. If you really want a big, big, you know, punish. Of course, also you can just walk backwards and net. Although we see the the odd hitbox in Sax is one two. He actually hits behind his head. There it is. That change. Is he gonna go for command grab? Usually, yep. Nobody texts that, man. It's really hard to tech. And uh, he tries to do, do another instance of him versus DJT. He landed that six times in a row. Of course, the command grab sets you up a, a mix of situation where you can do another command grab. All right, B Board player has momentum right now. Oh, the anti air does not throw him into the bomb. Here we go. I think I think Crazy's gonna have to break this if he wants to live. Oh wow, it, it dropped! What is going on? I cannot believe that that all happened. That was really weird. Normally you can just you can follow up no matter what after the ragdoll, and then I don't know everything whipped and went backwards. I think it must have been a keyboard magic trick, making everything start missing. Round one, fight. Now you see your attack sitting, now you don't. For those of you who don't know, keyboard is a magician. Keyboard is actually the material that they make playing cards out of. 
What's his name? Alright, some really brutal rush down by P-Board. Crazy should, uh, I guess Crazy is just gonna try to fish for that one reset, as usual. Uh, there's almost no way to get away from that amount of chip. Round two. From a Fight! Not, especially not when he has that much life left. Ooh, breaks after the bomb connects. Very good setup. Uses the bomb to cover his own teleport, making it unpunchable. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Drains his meter. This could be the end of EG keyboard player. At least for this, for this round. And with the reverse back two. That's gonna be it. 100%. Fight. And we did. All right, Pboard, Pboard taking the lead right now. And it's full meter too. This is gonna be really hard for Crazy. There's a bomb. Besides not. To oh, he does break. No more. No more X-ray. It's no longer a threat. I think that was too late in the combo for him to break. Well, most of the damage had already been done. So I just kept, just kept it going. All right, so now I believe the score is one one. Maybe I'm wrong. One one, two one, two one, crazy, crazy. What was it? Round one. Fight! Alright, maybe it's doing great. Alright, it, it's really hard to keep track if it's not your, your main intention. Especially three out of five. It's way easier two out of three. Today we actually changed from three uh, normally we do two out of three, which is the evil rule set. But we changed to three out of five, which is the MLG rule set. Three out of five, in my opinion, is a lot better. It feels a lot more balanced. It's a, it's a really good medium. Anything further than that's way too long. No, he does not. I think he, he choked right there because he realized that he didn't have a meter to do the two bar reset that he usually likes to do. We got drunk people. We got drunk people. It's, never, it's not a real tournament until you got until you got annoying chunk people, right? I say you know this is a real this is a successful tournament. Yeah, that's it. We are in a casino and uh, we're we're running over a little bit, so we got the you know the nine people. It happens. Yeah, this is actually a really lovely venue. It's a wonderful venue. It's peachy. It's uh. Dandy. Alright, match point for Crazy. Round three. Full meter for keyboard, so that means he will have that X-ray opportunity, but I think he should save break. Now, Crazy's about to get full meter too. Of course he wants to use that on a reset, although he broke with it. Here we go. Is he gonna, oh he should have gone for the reset right there. Crazy can oh, no, sorry. oh my god. Cyrax can very easily get a reset off of a straight anti net. Okay, here we go. He took the risk. It's not a risk that I like, but he's really going to have to follow it up. Uh, if worse comes to worse, Sarex does have Breaker. And that should be it. That's why I didn't think it was a good idea to use the X-Ray. Crazy drops the reset. Gives him another chance. Alright, down to the last hit for either player. And it ends with a jump kick, air to air jump kick. All right, so P-Board will take fourth, taking home.